How's it going, everyone? I'm FeatherGamer555, and welcome back to more Big Brother with Raining Rose. Hi. Why are you yawning? No. Anyway, <laughs> welcome back to more Big Brother, the new prophecy. In the previous episode, we did week 7, the double eviction, and week 8. It was amazing. I was having a great time with that one. I really hope you guys enjoyed it just as much as I did, and probably Rosa did. Yes. We loved it. We're Team Hawk Frost. We got Team Hawk Frost shirts now. We're just Team Hawk Frost. All the way. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Now we're moving on to week 9, the next double eviction, and week 10. It's going to be exciting to see how this plays out. It's going to be probably rather intense. So, I hope you guys are excited for that. Either way, who's going to win this HOH? Who was just the HOH? Hawk Frost? Uh, yes. Okay. That's who I was thinking it was. I don't know who could win. Um. Leaf Pool, maybe? Leaf Pool, Mothwing, and then it'll be all Hawk Frost, Sage of Wage anyway. It's probably gonna be Ashbur. I hope not. I hope he just doesn't win anything. You know, something to serve for Maybe Squirrel was... Flight? Oh, yeah. I'll go, I'm gonna go with Squirrel Flight. Okay, I'll go with Leaf Pool. Alright. Nightcloud wins head of household. I have no clue what this person's gonna do. Nightcloud is a confusing, confusing person. Yeah. I think I called her a wild card at the beginning. Oh yeah. Nightcloud begins the nomination ceremony. Midnight is safe. Hawk Frost is safe. Oh, perfect. Squirrel Flight is safe. Ashfur is safe. Nightcloud nominates Leafpool and Mothwing. See, look at that. Mothwing is already taking hits. Just because, yeah. like, she looks like the one who's been doing everything. But it's not. Anyway. Beetle. Nightcloud is HOH, and Leafpool and Mothwing as nominees will compete. Midnight, Squirrelflight, and Hawkfrost are all selected to compete. I want Hawkfrost to be very confusing right now. I want him to win, take Mothwing off, because he still needs her. Yeah. And then, who cares what happens afterwards? Or, or he could win. Promise Mothwing that he's going to yeah. save her. So then she's all confident and stuff, like whatever. And then nope. I'm good. And then he won't use it. That'd be amazing. I kinda hope that scenario happens. Cause like I said, this is the time to backdoor Mothwing to get rid of her. Yeah, if the chance is given, you might you might try it. Yeah, I bet he will. Alright, let's see. Oh, she's still winning comps. Mothwing wins power of veto. Oh man, what if this puts Hogfist on the block? Oh snap, that would suck. That would suck, yeah. Let's see. Oh no! It's happening. Oh no! <laughs> Leaf Pool and Mothwing stay by this should be saved. Mothwing uses the power of veto on herself. Nightcloud names Hogfrost as the replacement. Final nominees are Leaf Pool and Hogfrost. I think maybe Mothwing got smarter all of a sudden. And started realizing, like, and then told Nightcloud everything. Or maybe Nightcloud just really perspective and didn't see things. Very possible. Time. Did pick? She did predict the showmance at the start of the game with Stormfur and Brook. Yeah. And cut Either it down that instantly. Either Nightcloud thinks that Hawkfrost is doing nothing, and she wants Leaf Pool out. I hope it is Leaf Pool who's going out. Obviously. All right. Let's see. Oh god. <laughs> Leaf Pool and Hawk Frost face eviction. Midnight votes to evict Hawk Frost. Mothwing, thank you. Mothwing votes to evict Leaf Pool. Squirrel Flight votes to evict Leaf Pool. Ashfur votes to evict Hawk Frost. I don't know what Nightcloud's going to do. I hate it when it goes to a tie because then I'm nervous. Yep. Oh, this could be the end of our friend. No. The best friend. Oh, thank you, what? baby gods. <laughs> I love you. Oh <laughs> Leaf pool, hawk frost, face eviction. The vote is a two-two tie. Nightcloud evicts Leaf pool. Hawk frost talked his way off the block. He had some form of relationship with Nightcloud, apparently, that he was able to work with it. Ooh. Or he just pushed it to the point where Nightcloud was thinking, maybe Leaf pool is a worse or problem. Well, if you think about it, Nightcloud and Leafpool will kind of dislike each other. 
Because, mm. you know, the whole curl feather triangle. Oh. Square, whatever you want to count that as well. So let's say Hawk Frost played off that. Okay, yeah. But curl feather is not even here anymore. <laughs> they need to grow up. <laughs> they just got played They're by Hawk Frost. Hawk Frost <laughs> just. Yes. Hawk Frost just played to it and pushed it further. So it's safe. Time for the double eviction. Alright, uh, who do you want to win then? Well, I really don't mind who wins, I guess, as long as it's not Ashburn. I want Hawk Frost to stay safe though. That's true. But Squirrel Flight, I'm rooting for a little bit too. Not as much as Hawk Frost, obviously. Mm -hmm. And right now, Mothwing really needs to backdoor here. Yeah. Hawk Frost, you're setting her up to. Hawk Frost is setting her up to be such a target that all of a sudden she's got a lot of safety or a lot of ability to win the game now. Yeah. She needs to be backdoored. Definitely. Like now. So go Hawk Frost. It's double eviction. That's the time to do it. It's so quick. It's so sudden. Perfect timing. Go Hawk Frost. Is that what you're doing? Or what are you doing? Sure. I'll go with that too. That sounds good. like it. That sounds like a good it's the plan. best scenario. Yes. All right. Let's see. Oh goodness. <laughs> oh god, I'm scared. Mothwing wins head of household. So let's just assume she runs up to Hawk Frost and asks, "What do I do with this?" Yes. And then he's gonna be like, "Squirrel flight." Or Night Cloud and Squirrel Flight or something. I feel like that's what he would say. Yeah. But maybe that's not what Mothwing wants to do. So let's see. I was about to say, isn't that what I just said? No, I, I said uh, Night Cloud, not Midnight. <laughs> Moth Moth <laughs> Mothwing nominates Midnight and Squirrel Flight. Okay. Well, Squirrel Flight, we, we guessed her. I was, Maybe I they was want mostly right. Out now. I that is, you know what? Getting rid of Squirrel Flight and a double eviction is just as good. I bet it's not what Hawk Frost wanted, but since he has to keep playing off of it now, I'm sure he's okay with it. Yeah. Or it's a backdoor plan against Hawk Frost. As you can tell, I really love Hawk Frost. A lot. Mothwing is Edgewitch and Midnight and Squirrel Flight as nominees will compete. Ashfur, Hawkfrost, and Nightclub will play since everyone is eligible. Eligible. Go Hawkfrost. Yep. I'm at this point. It's so late in the game. It's like I just want him to win everything and just comp out and get to the end. Yes. You because, can't really pick people anymore. No. Now you pick who you want to win. Yeah. Exactly. I'm sure, people are against what I'm saying anyway. They probably all probably. like, oh, midnight, all the way. Oh, I hope not. <laughs> anyway, let's go. Midnight all the way. <laughs> Midnight <laughs> wins power of veto. Okay, so who do you think would go up? Is it gonna be Hawk Frost? Is it gonna be Ashfur as a pawn against Squirrel Flight? Or is it gonna be Night Cloud? I kind of hope it's Ashfur and then he is just a pawn because just, just to get rid of Squirrel Flight because that's character wise I would like Squirrel Flight to stay in and I would want Ashfur out. But game wise but game wise Getting rid of Squirrel Flight, assuming Mothwing is still playing under Hawk Frost's yeah. tutelage or whatever, which makes sense because they're both newbies at the game, but you know. Who knows what's gonna happen? Let's see. Oh my goodness, is this literally true? Like, is Mothwing literally with Hawk Frost? I love that this canon theory we've got going on has been true this whole game. I know, I love that. I love it when we predict like that and it actually happens. It's weird. Anyway, Midnight and Squirrel Flight stay by, they should be saved. Midnight using the power beetle on herself. Mothwing names Night Cloud as the replacement. Final nominees are Night Cloud and Squirrel Flight. So, pretty much what I said Hawk Frost was telling Mothwing to do. Yep. He had a he has a play in everything that's always happening, I swear. I think so. I swear he always does. Oh my gosh, I love her so much. And he's only been on the block once. <laughs> oh and it was my a gosh. Tie too. Yeah. And it was it was close and he still stayed. Yeah. That's amazing. Alright. Fiction time. Who do you think is leaving? Cause these are the two last biggest players next to Mothwing and Hawkfrost. I guess it really doesn't matter. Oh, it's a big threat leaving. 
Yeah. I feel like it's gonna be Nightcloud. Nightcloud did try to get rid of one of them. True. Let's see. <laughs> so true to everything. Nightcloud and Squirrelflight face eviction. Hawfrost votes to evict Nightcloud. Midnight votes to evict Squirrelflight. Ashfur votes to evict Nightcloud. Alright. Nightcloud and Squirrelflight face eviction. Nightcloud is evicted by a vote of 2 to 1. Squirrelflight, how did you still make it to week 10? You've been on the block more than anybody this season. Yeah. Absolutely. And she's still playing the game. That's awesome. Props to Squirrelflight. No kidding. So far, we're, it's set up for three people deserving to win this game. At this point, Ashfur needs to leave. Oh, yes. But game-wise, Mothwig needs to get backdoored. Mm-hmm. Like, right now. As soon as possible, pretty much. Yep. Because at this point, Arfrost is playing very risky by keeping her this long. Mm-hmm. But, I mean, he's had no choice. She's constantly won the veto to stay, won the HOH. She can't be backdoored. That is so true. She really can't. It's not happening. So even though we're saying Hawkfrost wants to do that, he can't do anything every time. Yeah, it just it's worked out to where he can't. She's getting lucky, because I'm pretty sure he's going to cut her as soon as he can. Oh yeah, definitely. Like, he's playing really true to his real character. It's scary. Weird psycho guy. Yep. But yeah, anyway, next stage of age, okay. Mothwing can't play. Who do you think's going for it? Right now, it's Hawk for us who has the best chance of winning this HOH, I think. Yeah, I would say so. You know, the re another reason this is a perfect time to backdoor Mothwing, she already can't play in the HOH. You just have that to is so true. He just has to hope she doesn't win the veto since everyone gets to play. Yeah. I wonder if that'll happen. I kind of hope it does. I want Hawk for us to win it. Put up, Squirrel Flight, and Midnight. One of them comes off. See him off one. Yep. I want to see that happen. Same. All right, Hawk Frost, you got this. H O H, buddy. Nope. Oh, this is gonna be stupid. <laughs> oh come on. We don't know what he's gonna do. No. Ashford wins. I don't know how it's old. This could be stupidly interesting or just stupid. Probably pretty stupid. All right, nominations. Ashfur begins the nomination ceremony. Hawk Frost wow. is saved, Squirrel Flight is saved, Ashfur nominates Midnight and Mothwing. How does Hawk Frost never end up on the block as an initial nominee? I have no idea. It's never happened. He's only been put on the block as a replacement. Yeah. Wow. I don't even know anymore. Alright. Okay. Ashfur is eight to eight, and Midnight and Mothwing as nominees will compete. Hawkfrost and Squirrelflight will play since everyone is eligible. Alright, like I said, this could be the chance Hawkfrost needs. He needs to win the veto, and then maybe we can go with that theory we have before, where he's gonna oh, make yeah. Mothwing comfortable and say, um, I've decided to use the power of veto on nobody. I wanna see that happen. That's probably, I feel like that's how he would do it. He'd play right on it, and then just at the last second, on no one. What a jerk if he does that. <laughs> yeah. Well, I assume we both want Hawk Frost to win this one. Yep. Let's go. It's gonna be both three. All right, Squirrel let's see. Flight wins power of you. I didn't even click, but okay. Way to be. I was, I was slow. Very slow. Okay. Um. Do you think she'd use it? Maybe. On midnight, maybe. Midnight has voted against her like every time. Oh, maybe not. Will she <laughs> or at save? Least from my memory. Yeah. Will she That's save cool. Mothwing? I don't think I don't she know. would. Uh, let's Granted, see. Granted, nobody has really used the power veto on anybody. It's That's like, true. It's gonna happen eventually. Nobody's kind of used thing. it on anybody and just saved themselves only. It's the only yeah, time. Yeah. So it's like you would think it would happen, but that's the thing. Stuff does that and it, it plays with their mind. Yeah. Let's see. Yes. Mothwing, or Midnight and Mothwing state why they should be saved. Squirrel Flight does not use the power of Vito. Final nominees are Midnight and Mothwing. I'm loving every episode, I swear. It's the best season ever right now. 
<laughs> okay, okay. So, who do you think's gone? Is it time for Hawkfrost to say see ya? Or is he gonna be risky and keep her to the final four? I honestly probably think that Mothwin should go. And I too hope much win, to too much comp her. wins. Yeah. It's too risky. Like, why? Yeah. At Where this at, at this point in the game, people know where people's games are at. You know who's the threat, you know who's not a threat. Mothwing's a threat. Definitely. And Hawk Frost is not gonna leave her there. Like, it, it, why? Anyway, yeah. let's, let's find out. Oh. Midnight and Mothwing face the victim. Squirrel Fly votes to evict Mothwing. Hawk Frost votes to evict Midnight. Hawk Frost? Dang, buddy. You know what? Maybe we're reading him wrong. Maybe he truly wants Mothwing at the end of the game to for a fair ending to the season. Maybe. And, you know, because I have a feeling uh, Ashfur is going to evict Mothwing. But... Well, it, maybe he wanted this to happen. Maybe he wanted it to go to a tie. Oh, mm, maybe. And cool. then maybe he talked to Ashford and is all like... Get rid of Mothwing. If it gets Mothwing. to be a tie, you gotta do this kind of thing. Yeah. Hmm. And because then it's like Hogfrost isn't looking bad in front of Mothwing. Instead, it looks like it's Ashford who did it. Yeah. So, so Hogfrost, I saved you. I tried. Yeah, I like that idea. That, that, it is a strategy. Alright, let's see. I think it's Mothwing. Midnight and Mothwing face eviction. The vote is a 1-1 one -one tie. Ashfur evicts Midnight. Okay, I guess Ashfur didn't believe then. anything that Hawkfrost was selling. That could be bad for Hawkfrost. That, that might be bad, yeah. Maybe he talked to Mothwing. Maybe. Dang, all we need to see is Ash for gone, and then the final three would be amazing. Yes. Alright, that's pretty much it for this episode, though. I really enjoyed this one. You clearly enjoyed it, too. It was exciting. It was awesome. We had a close call, but we almost lost Hawk Frost in this episode, too. It almost yeah. happened. Okay, that was awesome. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. We'll see you next time for the finale. It's going to be awesome. So... That's pretty much it. See you next time in the next episode of Big Brother. Alright, see ya. Bye.